it's Max. Steve. And we're going to resin a whole bunch of pieces all at once. Just get her done. Yeah, we're putting our gloves on, we've got our masks on, and here's a spreader we like to use. It's reusable. Yeah, just wipe it off and you begin. So I'm putting part A and part B, measuring equal amounts, and then we're going to mix like it's uh, nobody's business. <laughs> go team, go. So how long do we mix for? Uh, two minutes or so, maybe three. Yeah. So that's a fast two, three minutes. Okay, I'm pouring it, and Rebecca's following behind, just spreading it, spreading it all over the place. And I didn't mix nearly enough, so it I'm is. gonna. I call it, I like to call it dump and smear. Dump and smear. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm mixing up the rest, the rest that will need to finish it, so that we don't waste too much. And go 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 go! <sighs> it's a bit of a race because it starts to cure after about 20 minutes, but uh, I think we spread this in what maybe seven or eight. Yeah, something like that. And so I'm just kind of going over looking for any little imperfections and and putting more in places where it looks like it needs it. And just working around the sides, getting all the drips off, and yep. you're golden. And here's the exciting part, the blowtorch. You want to tell them a bit about this? Yeah, so this, you can pick this up in a, a hardware store. It's very cheap and uh, it looks like a big scary thing, but it's not. You just light her up and go kind of methodically like Steve's doing right there, up and down, side to side. Make sure you cover the whole area, and that's how you get all your. Ooh, nice things, but uh, yeah, that's how you get all your bubbles out. Yeah, and you can you can see the bubbles being forced to the surface just when you run it over the uh, top of the resin, so you can see what you're doing, and it makes it worth it. So I I highly recommend this. We don't do any of them without a torch anymore. If you're picky about bubbles, then that's what you gotta do. Yeah, and the torch also burns any hairs or dust. Okay. And, oh well, we're done. There you go. Okay. Bye bye. Bye basement. So we want to see what you're using your art resin for. Upload your images onto the art gallery at artresin.com or just go there to get inspired by others as well. For answers to all your questions about art resining, just visit the FAQ at artresin.com and you can buy stuff there too. So we're always making new videos. If you like, you can subscribe and we'll see you next time. If you want to see some more art resin videos, just check these out.